Welcome to the Steve Ames Show with guitarist Sandy Renda, pianist Mike Yanuzzi, and my special guests. And now on with the show. <laughs> Smile, darn ya, smile You know this old world is a great world after all Smile, darn ya, smile And right away watch Lady Luck pay you a call Things are never black as they are painted Time for you and Joy to get acquainted Make life worthwhile Come on and smile, darn ya, smile Smile, darn ya, smile You know this old world is a great world after all Smile, darn ya, smile And right away watch Lady Luck pay you a call Things are never black as they are painted Time for you and Joy to get acquainted Make life worthwhile Come on and smile, darn ya smile Thank you, smile, darn ya smile And we're going to make you smile tonight on the Steve Ames Show Tape right here at the West 22 Diner in Springfield, New Jersey. With the two mighty musicians at the guitar, Sandy Renda. And at the keyboard, Mike Yanuzzi. This next tune was a big hit recording for the Mills Brothers. And now it's my turn. I'm gonna buy a paper doll that I can call my own A doll that other fellows cannot steal And then the flirty, flirty guys With their flirty, flirty eyes Will have to flirt with dollies that are real When I come home at night she will be waiting She'll be the truest doll in all the world I'd rather have a paper doll to call my own than have a fickle-minded real live girl. Come home at night, she will be waiting. She'll be the truest doll in all the world. I'd rather have a paper doll to call my own than have a fickle minded real live gal. Well, Sandy Rand and Mike Yanuzzi, here we are in our new surroundings, the West 22 Diner in Springfield. Mike, you've got your own painting right there above the piano, right the other way, the other way. And Sandy, you've got this beautiful tree right over here. Very nice. Right. What's the number for tonight for you and Mike? This is a pop song a number of years ago, back in maybe the 60s, early 70s, by a, a singer whose name was Chris Montez. The song is called... Call me, but we're going to do a little jazz flavor. Very nice. Let's hear it for Sandy and Mike. One, two, three, four. If you're feeling sad and lonely, there's a service I can render to the one who loves you only. I could be so warm and tender. Call me. Oh, baby, it's late. You can call me. Tell me it's late, you can call me Tell me and I'll be around If you find a friend's desert you And there's somebody thinking of you I'm the one who'll never hurt you Baby, that's because I love you Call me Don't be afraid, you can call me oh, Baby, it's late, but just call me Tell me and I'll be around now don't forget, because if you left me, I will always stay by you. 
You gotta trust me, that's how it must be. There's so much that I can do. Don't be afraid, you can call me oh, Baby, it's late, but just call me Tell me and I'll be around Now don't forget me, cause if you left me I will always stay by you You gotta trust me, that's how it must be There's so much that I can do Oh! Oh, baby, it's late, but just call me. Tell me it's late, but just call me. Yeah. Tell me and I'll be around. Yeah. Old TV show. When I was a kid, I idolized this young man. I worshipped him. I wanted to be like him when I grew up. Maybe I might make it. How about a song from Steve Ames? Steve Ames. A very and this is, uh, and her name? Joy K. Joy K might want to do a song in a little while anyhow, but as for now, we play for Steve Hayes. Yeah. Please set the scene, tell us when we can watch. Tell us what I'm talking about, you know. Talk about. <laughs> I'm going to talk about Joe. I want to wish you a happy 48th anniversary. And uh, I'm one of Joe's younger friends. I've known Joe 22 years since 1974 when you were doing a tribute to Eddie Cantor at Temple Emmanuel in New York City. The other night Steve and I went to see Milton Berle on his 88th birthday, the big award show at the, uh, what the Waldorf. World, World of Astoria. And he tells the audience that uh, even though he's 88 years old, he still makes love almost every night. Almost on Monday, almost on Tuesday, almost on Monday. <laughs> and he was sensational, right? That was quite a night. And then Henny Young, what Henny Young, Henny Young did? Nights in one week. Milton Berle's night and Joe Franklin's night. That's really something. Ladies and gentlemen, my accompanist at the keyboard, who's the musical director of my cable TV show for uh, Channel 57 on Comcast Cablevision, Miss Joy Kay, right over here. Like all of you here tonight, I love listening to the Joe Franklin radio show every Saturday night. I'm up right up from midnight until 5 o'clock in the morning. And the biggest thrill is when Joe digs up an old vaudeville recording, something from 1912 that nobody else has. So here's a song that was introduced by Eva Tangway in the early days of vaudeville and later revived by Judy Garland. Here we go. I don't care what they may think of me. I'm happy, go lucky. Some say that I'm plucky, so jolly and we're free. I don't care, I don't care if I do get the mean and stony stare. If I'm not successful, it won't be distressful, cause I don't care. revived that when she played Carnegie Hall many, many years later. Right now I'd like to do a song which was introduced by one of the most beautiful women who ever graced the screen. We just lost her about a month ago, Dorothy Lamore. How many Dorothy Lamore fans do we have here? She was not only beautiful, but she could also sing. And she introduced this song in The Road to Utopia, 
along with her friends Bob Hope and Bing Crosby. And the uh, song was written by Jimmy Van Usen and Johnny Burke. Let's see if you remember it. When Madame Pompadour was on the ballroom floor, said all the gentlemen, obviously, the Madame has the cutest personality. And think of all the books about the fairies' looks, what was it made her the toast of Harry? She had a well-developed personality. Now think of Romeo and Juliet, Imperio and Period, Jupiter and Juno, you know. And when Salome danced and had the boys in trance, no doubt it must have been easy to see. She knew just how to use her personality. Now why are certain girls offered certain things, like sable coats and diamond rings, by men who wear their spats right? That's right. Now don't you think she's smart and has the kindest heart? Oh, what a wonderful sister she'd be. Just tell her how you like her personality. 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 You know what we're going to do right now? We're going to have a sing-along, because I know everybody loves to sing. Now, we got a lot of beautiful women in the audience tonight. I wonder if we have any lady here tonight by the name of Dolores. Is any no, not you. No, not you. Is anybody named Dolores in the audience tonight? Really? Seriously? Yes. Do we have a Dolores? Yes. Come on up. I got something special for you. We really do have a Dolores? Yes. Let's hear it for Dolores. Come on up. Come on up. I understand that Dayton's restaurant recently celebrated their 50th anniversary. Am I correct? Well, this song goes back about 50 years to the 1940s. Are you Dolores? Guess what I'm going to sing for you. Can you sing it too? Folks, if you know the words, let's all serenade this lovely lady with the song Dolores. How I love the kisses of Dolores, everybody. Marie or Emily or Doris, but only my Dolores. From a balcony above me, she whispers, Love me, and throws a rose. Ah, but she is twice as lovely as the rose she throws. I would die to be with my Dolores, everybody. I, I, Dolores. I was made to serenade Dolores. Chorus after chorus. Just imagine eyes like moonrise, a voice like music, and lips like horn. If I could make Dolores mine, all mine. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to leave you with something very, very special. The, the other night at the Milton Berle dinner, Joey Adams got up and talked about the man that everybody in show business idolized when they were growing up. Milton Berle idolized this man. 
Joey Adams idolized this man. Richard Curtis idolized this man. Who am I talking about? Joe I'm Franklin. talking about Joe Franklin and Al Jolson, right? Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to sing a song that Al Jolson introduced called You Made Me Love You. Here we go. Oh, the, uh, we got a little help there. We got a drummer. Here's the song. That's okay. We got a little help. Here's the song that Al Jolson introduced in 1913. And also Judy Garland got to sing it. Here it is. I didn't want to do it You made me want to And all the time you knew it I guess you always knew it You made me happy sometimes You made me sad Sing along if you know the words But there were times you made me feel so bad You made me cry for I didn't want to tell you I didn't want to tell you I want your love That's true Yes I do Did I do You know I do Give me, give me what I cry for you know you've got the kind of kisses that I die for. You know you made me love you. Oh, you made me love you. I didn't want to do it. I didn't want to do it. Oh, you made me want to. I guess you always knew it. You made me happy sometime, and you made me glad. But there were times, dear, you made me feel so bad. You made me cry for. I didn't want to tell you. I didn't want to tell you. I want your love, that's true, yes I do, did I do, you know I do, give me, give me what I cry for, you know you've got the kind of kisses that I die for, you know you made me. who has many talents. She played piano for me a while back and she's also a great singer. Please welcome Miss Joy Kay right over here. All the way from Wisconsin. You walked it, right? <laughs> Thank you, Steve. I owe Steve so much. I'm just thrilled to be with you. Thank you. So, and th I'm thrilled to be here and, and thank you, Joe, for letting me share these two moments. You know what um, you want to do?
right now a centennial tribute to a great singing star, Frankie Lane, who was born 100 years ago on March 30th, 1913, in Chicago, Illinois. Frankie Lane was one of the top vocalists of the 1940s and 1950s, with many hit recordings, including That's My Desire, That Lucky Old Son, and Mule Train. He also had success in reviving standards, like this one, written by Dorothy Fields and Jimmy McHugh. But how can I help it? Don't blame me. Can't you see when you do the things you do? It's hard to conceal the thrill that I'm feeling. Don't blame me. I can't help it if that doggone moon above makes me need someone like you to love blame your kiss as sweet as a kiss can be then blame all your charms that melt in my arms but don't blame me Don't blame me. In the 1950s, Frankie Lane appeared in movies for Columbia Pictures and also had his own TV show on CBS. Frankie Lane continued making recordings and concert appearances throughout the 1960s, 70s, and 80s. In 2005, Frankie Lane celebrated his 92nd birthday. I wrote to him for the occasion, and Frankie sent me these two autographed pictures we're showing on the screen right now. So we close our Frankie Lane centennial celebration with another standard he revived, music Maestro, please. Tonight, I mustn't think of her. Music, maestro, please. Tonight, tonight I must forget how much I need her. So Mr. Leader, play. Your lilting melodies, rack time, chest time, swing, any old thing to help me ease the pain that solitude can bring. She used to like waltzes, so please don't play a waltz. She danced divinely, and I loved her so, but there I go tonight. Tonight I must forget No more memories Swing hard to 
tonight I must forget Music, maestro, please